It has got to be wonderful to be a kid in today's age of information technology, where modern digital and mechanical achievements continue to pave a way into the very toys this new generation has had the privilege to enjoy. And let's be clear, I'm saying this with absolute jealousy because in my childhood, we thought slinky glasses and whoopee cushions were high tech. <laughs> in this episode of Techie Tech News, we summon our inner child to create a list of toys we think are the best high tech toys today. Ladies and gentlemen, children of all ages, our top five high tech toys for the modern age. This is Techie Tech News. Engage. In this special episode of Techie Tech News, we've received a very special request from two of our Techie Tech subscribers. They requested a review of some of the hottest and coolest high tech toys on the market right now. So, we've dedicated an episode at our viewer's request. Christopher and Vivi, this one's for you. Every generation spanning from the mid 20th century up until today has had their share of technological innovations in the toy retail market. From the skateboard to Mr. Potato Head to Dungeons and Dragons, companies work tirelessly to develop new products to win the hearts of all children alike. One of those historic innovations came in 1960 where a new and revolutionary game just hit the market called the Etch-a-Sketch. Its ability to use dials to etch in an analog image into a TV-looking handheld base was a hit, with a sale of 600,000 units at a price of $299 US dollars each. With today's inflation, that would be about $30.64 today. Since then, there have been thousands of new toys hitting the retail stores trying to be the latest and greatest toy ever. Fast forward into today's toy market and you can see a plethora of updated toys from the past with technology integrated into them. But more importantly, there are all new smart toys that simply wouldn't be possible without the help of modern day semiconductors and the software that drives them. I have a confession to make. In making this episode and after doing all my research on all the toys that we were considering for the video, I was totally guilty of buying two of these toys because they were simply awesome. And being a bit of a man child, it really wasn't that hard of a sale. Don't worry, I'll let you know which ones and why later. So without further ado, let's begin with the Techie Tech News Top 5 High Tech Toys for the Modern Age. Toy number one. Power Up 4.0 RC Smartphone Controlled Paper Airplane Kit The Power Up is what happens when a pilot turned inventor goes full tilt nerd and creates one of the coolest toys I have ever laid my eyes on. As a kid who loved feats of engineering marvels, I would have begged my parents to death for one of these for Christmas. The Power Up 4.0 features a front mounted aeronautic flight controller followed by a support spine that attaches to a gyroscope and accelerometer sensor. This spine continues to the end where two electric motors sit. The whole apparatus mounts to the paper airplane and transforms it into 10 minutes of RC plane action. This kit comes with multiple sheets of construction paper with pre-built markings on them to show you how to build their basic airplane called the Invader. From there, you connect your flight computer to the Power Up app on your smartphone, where you can control the paper airplane. But that's not all. This flight computer uses the data telemetry from the onboard sensors to help you stabilize the plane should you have any imbalances, including if you run into any light wind. It works so well that they even flew a piece of lettuce with it. Are you kidding me right now? Lettuce? Then, they take it a step further and introduce an autopilot feature that allows you to go hands-off while the app flies the plane for you. Once you get comfortable with the system, you can activate what they call acro mode, where you can do loops, barrel rolls, and hammerheads. The body and spine are made up of carbon fiber to help reduce the flex and weight, along with a nylon reinforced nose for impact protection. The motors are so powerful that you can fly styrofoam and balsa wood models as well. They even sell them with some of their kits. 
Flying your paper airplane will last a glorious 10 minutes, which you can resume after a 30 minute recharge period via micro USB connector. The power up can see a max speed of about 20 miles per hour and you can fly to a claimed 230 feet. If your power up goes beyond that, it has an auto land feature and indicates its last known location on your phone for easy recovery. This toy deserves a high tech standing ovation as it has taken a simple yet elegant art of paper airplane building and augmented it into an amazing way to entertain yourself or your kids. If you can't tell by the enthusiasm in my voice, this was definitely one of the toys that I ended up buying for myself. Between being able to turn your paper airplane into an RC plane and being able to fly lettuce, yeah, I, I was sold. Toy number two, Flying Orb Gyro Mini Drone. The Flying Orb is a gyro mini drone designed to force air through it to counteract the forces of gravity just like a regular drone. However, this little device has been well tuned with the help of an onboard computer to help it with stability. It turns itself into a silly and near weightless ball for all kinds of kiddish tomfoolery and shenanigans. The AI programmed onboard chip was developed to ensure the predictability of the flying orb. It allows the user to create unique flight patterns and flight paths, giving the flying orb another rule of physics to play on. The body is constructed of a lightweight ABS plastic and it also serves to protect it from users accidentally getting their fingers caught within the housing. And because of the nature of the device, you can totally use it while you're in your house as a minimum space is required. Just don't use it in areas where you can get into too much fun if you know what I mean. The motor spinning this drone is brushless for smooth power delivery and it comes with a 200 mAh lithium battery. A battery that size allows for play times of 8 to 10 minutes with a recharge time of 25 minutes via a USB connector. This neat little mystery also comes with internal LED strips to make for low lighting adventures even more eventful. They even blink to let you know that you're in a low power condition. The flying orb looks like a ton of fun and its price point is excellent. It makes for a great time killer and definitely an affordable gift should you know somebody who could use one. Moving on, toy number three, Battle Action Laser Tag 2.0 Laser Tag Kit System. Laser Tag was always fun, but the effort to get people together and to make an event out of it kind of killed the spontaneity of playing a pickup game or two like you could with other more convenient games. Now, with Battle Action Laser Tag 2.0, you can literally start a laser tag session right there in your basement. The kit comes with four laser guns, four chest wearables with hit sensors and LED hit point screens, four back wearables with hit sensors, and a charging station for all the equipment. The game starts with an adjustable 1 to 99 life point system where you can have three sensors to shoot at, being the chest wearable, the back wearable, and the gun itself. This gives the users a 306 degree angle of attack. The chest piece and the laser gun have LCD screens to show you the point counts left and to notify you when you're out of points. The guns themselves can use one of four configurations, semi-auto, fully auto, laser, and rocket. Each mode has a different point damage amount, but requires more reloads due to lack of ammo. Oh yeah, you heard me correctly. It has digital ammo and requires you to reload once you're out of ammo. I am sure it helps to avoid your casual Rambo from just jumping out of the woodworks with a spray and pray strategy. Even more impressive is the fact that you can add as many kits as you wish. From a group of 4 to a group of 40, if all your friends get into it, scaling will not be an issue. The gun's infrared laser is also set to child safe emissions while helping with false reflective shots against other reflective surfaces. You also have multiple modes like team, solo, and stealth. Batteries last up to eight games worth of playing and can be charged with the included charging station. All devices come with internal lithium ion batteries. You can also play with up to four individual teams with gun ranges up to 150 feet or 45 meters. Although recharge times were not really disclosed with the kit, this kit is reverse compatible with its first generation version. I would totally rock this kit if I was in my early teen years again. Why would you play Monopoly when you could gain some serious street cred as a laser sling oh, and a crack yeah. shot? 
Okay, okay, too much. But man, what a fun kit to own. And now on to number four on our list. Toy number four, Makebok Mbot Ranger. STEM educational toy using adrenal programming. My inner nerd just about jumped out of the screen when I saw M-Block's STEM educational toy, the M-Bot Ranger. This kit is for the DIYers who want to know how to build and program robots. This kit will allow you to build up to three configurations they call the Land Raider, the Dashing Raptor, and the Nervous Bird for obvious reasons. The remarkable build quality of this kit was truly designed for reassembly in mind, as the components of this kit are top notch. As said before, the beauty in this kit is your ability to go from build stage to programming to finally going to operation using a handheld or a smartphone or smart device based app system. Those quality components help the MBOT navigate some fairly rough terrain too. They state that the components of their kit can actually last a lifetime. This robotic kit comes with the Mi Auriga mainboard and its associated modules like the ultrasonic sensor, the line tracking sensors, two light sensors, a gyroscope sensor, 12 RGB LEDs, a buzzer, a temperature sensor, a Bluetooth communicator, and the drive motors. The programming can be performed in two different languages such as Scratch or Druno, and its interface is user-friendly for the purpose of training. The robot does require 6 AA batteries that are not included, so I would jump on Amazon and get a 6 pack of those lithium ion rechargeables with charger. Are you looking for a toy that requires a great deal of attention to detail? Want to turn that little bundle of non-rent paying joy into the next Elon Musk? Or perhaps you have a big kid who just loves these types of smart educational toys, like yourself. It's definitely a good buy. The last, but not the least on this list. Toy number five, Elik, interactive gaming figure. While researching this toy, at first I kind of shrugged it off, thinking it was more of a gimmick than substance. But the more and more time I spent understanding its functions and what it can do, I began to start to see the genius behind this little guy and his big personality. You see, a toy doesn't always need to be something that you have to play with actively, forcing you to make a conscious decision as to when you need to allocate precious time towards using it. The genius in this toy is in its passive play. It reacts to your environment and it attempts at being a desk companion and to help liven up your work and study area. This electronic pet is full of emotions, interactive features with idle animations as well. Elik will time and time try to interact with you and there's going to be times where you'll try to interact with him, testing you to try to get different responses from him. There are so many different responses from this little e-pet, like its fear of heights, senses of impact and thunder. We'll just start dancing when there's music and there's a wide range of facial expressions that he can perform. It can even get feisty with you as it tries to chop you with its sword or shoot you with a laser gun. But you can also fight back with a little boop to his head. The robot comes with three touch sensors, a front activated button, a magnetic pogo pin for other units like him, a microphone, a vibration motor, a speaker, a shock sensor, and an infrared sensor. When you pair him with another unit like him, a whole new world of interaction begins. Check this out. They will come alive and just start actively talking to one another in a host of sessions made from comedic gold. Add even more and they will have a full blown party. It's absolutely hilarious. They can also be set to role playing modes so they can be active in the background as you work and play. All of this tech genius is possible due to the internal processing board that receives updates constantly and they keep adding more personalities and content to the unit day by day. Elik also has a type C power USB connector to his back along with a lithium ion battery. 
It is such a fun toy. You can even set an easy timer with them or just periodically play a game with them. Being a desk jockey myself, I could not resist this toy and just went ahead and purchased it, making this the second toy in the list that I bought. He just feels like a pet that I don't have to walk and feed and honestly, I feel like this was one of the best purchases for a toy I've ever made. In truth, all of these toys are really awesome and we would recommend any of them to yourselves, your friends, or your family. The prices are reasonable and the reviews, they just speak for themselves. I have left you links for all of these toys in the description below. Thank you so much for watching this episode of Techie Tech News. Stay tuned for the next episode and please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe for more content.